Sascha here at the IDF 2009 show floor in San Francisco and as you can see we are at the Linpus booth and over here is a friend of us, it's uh, Warren Coles, who already did some introduction uh, doing Computex for us. Warren, how are you doing? Great, thanks. Warren, can you, can you please show us what's, what's new with Linpus and you know, how your operating system, your different ones, developed and evolved over the last couple of months? Okay, we've actually now got three products based on Mobilin. This is our own generic version of our Olympus, it's the new version of Olympus Linux Lite. And here we have what is called our live desktop application. Now, a lot of people coming out with dashboard style interfaces to give you access to uh, your instant messaging, your online uh, life, and uh, whatever's going on inside your computer. Right. What we've done here is you have six sections here favorite websites, these are all thumbnails coming in live, uh, and your recent objects. Now, social networking, what we've done is categorized it here so that. You have uh, Flickr, and then you have Twitter, and then, one. And then you have uh, this is Last FM, and then right. MySpace. And so we go back here, and also for and one little module we've added that we didn't have before was Webmail. So, right, that's new. So, so you're is, aggregating a lot of feeds uh, from different social medias and networks, but also emails and instant messaging right. on the front page. Gmail, Hotmail. AOL. Oh, cool. So, you really, the whole point here is you really just don't need to bother to open your browser. You've got so much right. information coming into right. your desktop. That's fantastic. And what we did here is because uh, Netbook is a small uh, UI, so what we have is to give you extra space and some extra thumbnails. You click over here, and you've right. got eight in total. We have large previews. That looks good. And Very then, snappy. Yep, and you can just directly open the application from here. Looking good. So when we get over to the next system, that's um, your Quick OS. Yeah, absolutely. I think we, I, I, the first video I did was during CBIT. Mm. Uh, uh, you had an early version of it, right? That's and right. it completely changed already the GUI right now. It looks way better in my opinion right now. Yep, we've updated the look and film. We just feedback from the customers is they really don't want that many applications right. inside. You, you've got your so now we just basically have our browser, we have Skype, uh, and then some more, also some interesting applications to help you use, uh, to interact with Windows. For example, this one called PC PIM. Okay. Uh, basically, if you have your Windows open, when you close down Outlook, it will copy the contents of your calendar and your email and allow you to see it inside. Great. Quick OS. This saves you a little bit more time. Absolutely, that looks great, and that, that's definitely new. I haven't seen this uh, before uh, with your Quick OS. Yeah, absolutely. Looking great. So, what's our next one here? Oh, let's press the button. <laughs> this is Limpus Mobile in V2 Enhanced. Why is it enhanced? Well, if you look at the right-hand side on the, the, the Mobile in M Zone, right. it basically has eight squares, all social networks thrown together. Uh, Twitter, MySpace, uh, again, Last FM. Now, what we've done to make it easier for you to find your information and to give you more information is to make a little tab for each one. Just click over. That's really cool. So you just don't have to leave this uh, yeah. final, uh, this this front side or your front page. Mm. You get all the information yeah. right on all on, on the same side. I really like that. Well, and compared to the generic Moblin that you download from Moblin.org, yeah, you know, the, as I say, it has the eight thumbnails together. It doesn't uh, categorize the different social networks. Right. And we also added the webmail module here. That's good. Yeah, I definitely like the webmail uh, module. Mm. Otherwise, at tools and applications level, what we've done, we've integrated our live update function. Okay. Which is, a live update is what we call a robust commercial live update because it can identify your device and, and then send you the right patches and upgrades depending on your device and manufacturer. Right. Uh, which is definitely important for the average user, you know, that, so that they don't have to bother about this mm. and they have a nice update feature okay. in your version here. So next one would be, um, um, that's the, the Olympus uh, Lite, oh sorry, that, that's the version that we've already, already seen on the Acer? Absolutely, but it's been mo upgraded to be Mobile V2 compliant. Okay. So what, what we've done, we've added a preview windows, 
oh, put it in a different application. That's nice. On the desktop, and some pretty nice clutter, clutter effects. Oh yeah. Very smooth. Looking good, looking good. And finally, something I haven't seen before from you guys is uh, the Olympus Quick OS plus the Google gadgets. Yep, so here. Let's see it over here. All the specs. We've just done it from a different angle, so again, very fast, very simple, very easy to use, but here the icons lead to Google gadgets. Web video. This will go. If you're online, you can get YouTube coming in here. Right. So unfortunately this machine is not connected to the internet right now, but I think we can get it here now. It's just connected to all these different Google gadgets. Mm. And uh, yeah, just a, just a front end where you, that, that you need to go to the internet, right? You, yeah. you really need to be connected to use this one. Mm. And um, yeah, looking great. I love the design of it. Oh, it's a kind of easy mode, simple GUI um, that immediately connects you to all the different services. Great, great lineup uh, from Linpus again. We really, really developed a lot of stuff during the last couple of months. So thank you so much, Warren. This is Sasha for netbooknews.com at the Linpus booth doing IDF 2009.